you have to remove your fingerprint and pattern then go to system about phone and tap on build number then go to developer option click on OAM unlock disable automatic system updates and enable USB debugging now connect your phone to with your PC and then click on there and tap for more option and click on transfer files this is very important then you have to download mia1gcam.zip and xiaomi mia1 usb driver from the link that i have described We have to unzip the files. Go to device manager. Just checking and go to portable portable devices click on mia1 and click on update drivers and browse my computer to driver but then select xiaomi mia1 driver folder xiaomi usb driver folder and click on ok and click on next then close then go to mia1 gcam mi a1 gcam folder and click on gcam mi a1 open it as administrator click on install drivers i will install both the version 1.43 and 1.3 click on next finish now I, I will download version I will install version 1.3 also because I don't know whether version is working so it is better to install both the version finish now click on enable HAL3 your phone will now allow ok on your phone not on your computer it is important your phone will stuck on bootloader fast boot be patient Here you can see the phone is stuck on fast food then then you have to go device manager again here you can see a android update driver and browse my computer for driver software and then then select the folder of you xiaomi usb driver that you extracted click on next installing driver android adv interface installed close then click on android again update driver 
browse my computer forever again then click on let me pick from a list and click on android device next then select first one android adb interface version next click on yes done now the twrp mode will boot don't touch your phone let the phone do the rest of the work by itself some say that you have to swipe but I will say don't swipe just see the process yes the work is done here here you will see finalized now you can unplug your device from your computer another important note that your computer's dotnet framework version will have to be 4.6 plus click on android click on camera google camera and allow then go to settings and advance hdr parameters will be super high portrait mode enable use gsl and hd quality 100% and improve photos in low light and show dirty lens warning now disable motion and enable face retouching and disable flash on selfie mode but you can use the flash in rear camera don't use it in selfie mode and then force stop google camera and then open it again and now you can disable oem unlocking and usb debugging and enable system updates